Good morning and welcome to AM Update for May 6th. I'm Jen Zielinski with some top stories for the day. The situation in Fort McMurray remains volatile. No one is allowed to return home as firefighters continue to battle an intense blaze estimated at 85,000 hectares. This morning, thousands of evacuees who were stranded at oil field camps north of the city were moved in a massive convoy along Highway 63. 50 vehicles are being allowed to go through at a time while air monitoring overhead. Castanet will have the latest on the Fort McMurray wildfires throughout the day. Here in BC, our northern communities are also dealing with an extreme wildfire risk. Two blazes in the Prince George Fire Centre that were previously identified as the Beaton Airport Road Fire and the Stoddart Road Fire have combined. As a result of this fire, the Alaskan Highway, Highway 97, has been closed 45 kilometres north of Fort St. John in both directions. Back in the Okanagan, a West Kelowna resident is shaking her fist after watching a man use an area of Glen Rosa Road as his personal garbage dump. The man, who was driving a dark-coloured van, dumped an old sofa set and a stove on the side of the road. Students at Mount Boucherie School will be holding a 24-hour drumathon today to honour missing and murdered Aboriginal women across Canada. The event is open to the public and starts at 10 a.m. Looking to the weather, the fog is expected to clear this morning and the sun will shine. The high for the day, 25. Tomorrow is looking like the hot spot for the week, sunny and 29 degrees. For these stories and more, make sure to check castanet.net. I'm Jen Zielinski for Castanet News.